Welcome back. Well, for the first time since the city of Holmes Beach eliminated more than 1,000 parking spots on the beach, city and county leaders, they met today to talk about solutions and their options for more parking on that small island. An ABC Action News reporter, Wendy Lane, was at that meeting and has more on the concerns and possible solutions to the beach parking issue. Every road on Holmes Beach has a beach access point, which is great. The problem is that the parking at these access points and even on any residential road is extremely limited. Only a couple cars can park at each spot. It sucks. Brittany Millington says getting to the beach has been difficult. Because we can't ever find parking. Today was actually the first day and and since and we've been here, yeah, 14 days that we found a parking spot. She says when they can't find parking, they have to walk like Jody Allen and his family do. We know that uh, parking very limited. And parking became even more limited last year when the city of Holmes Beach permanently removed more than 1,100 street parking spots. With more than 26,000 cars coming onto the island every day, Holmes Beach Mayor Judy Titsworth says their little community couldn't handle the amount of traffic in their residential neighborhoods. I'm sorry. I'm sorry that it was under my years of being mayor that we finally had to put in a limit. But Manatee County leaders want the spots reopened. So that Manatee County residents who own and maintain the beaches on Anna Maria Island are able to access those beaches. In a heated discussion with Manatee County leaders, Mayor Titsworth expressed her concerns. You guys are looking at the big picture. I look at the small picture. What are the solutions? The possible solutions discussed included alternative beach parking spots like the elementary school, the library, or nearby churches, and adding more restrooms, as well as keeping the traffic lights green longer to improve traffic flow on and off the island. So now we've both said our piece, and now it's time for the, the real behind the scenes work to start and to, for us to work together to try and find ways to open up more parking spaces. The group plans to meet again in a few weeks to follow up on the proposed parking solutions. Until then, families like Allen's say they don't mind walking a little to get to paradise. You'll sacrifice to do what you like to do, but the end result's always good. In Holmes Beach, Wendy Lane, ABC Action News.